Hello, my lovely students. How are you? Today, we will start Unit 6 for Mega Goal 5, the Gender Divide. Today, we will listen and discuss a text about how men and women behave differently. Then, we will identify some new vocabularies. And finally, we will ask and answer some questions about the text. At first, do you think you know a lot about men and women? Answer true or false for these statements, then check your answers when with the results of gender studies. What's the meaning of gender? Gender means category male and female. Okay. Listen carefully, please, and check your answer with true or false. Do you think you know a lot about men and women? Answer true or false for these statements. Then check your answers with the results of gender studies. One, women talk more than men. Two, women tend to worry more than men. Three, men are more truthful than women. Four, men are more easily bored than women. Five, women have a greater tolerance for pain. Six, women live longer than men. I think. Do you write your answers? Now, let's listen to a dialogue between Sandy and Amal about women and men behaviors. Women talk much more than men. That's just a stereotype, though I do think women talk more than men about certain things. Like what? Women like to talk about their feelings, but men usually don't. Men would rather talk about sports or cars. Typical. Do you agree with the Sandy and Amal ideas? Okay, now we will listen to this text and then we will identify the difficult words. Now, paragraph number one. One, the common stereotype that women talk more than men is wrong. In fact, recent research shows that there is very little gender difference in how much people speak. Some research suggests that men tend to speak more than women in formal settings and that women speak more in informal situations. One study revealed that women speak an average of about 16,000 words a day, and men do too. Two. So, both men and women talk more, but in different situations. Paragraph number two. Studies show that women worry more frequently and more often than men. This may be due to the fact that women's brains produce less of a brain chemical called COMT, which controls anxiety. Having less of this chemical can make it harder for a person to stop worrying. Anxiety. What's the meaning of the word anxiety? It means worry. Anxiety means worry. Then you can paragraph. Three, women lie frequently and men do too. However, research shows that women and men tend to lie about different things. Women are more likely to lie in order to try to not hurt a person's feelings. They are also more likely to lie to try to avoid a conflict. However, you are more likely to be told a lie by a man for a different reason. Men more often lie in order to make themselves seem more impressive. So, men and women lie, but for different reasons. What's the meaning of conflict? Conflict means problem. Okay, paragraph number four. 
before, studies show that men have more restless temperaments than women. For example, women seem to have a capacity to adjust to repetitive tasks, but men don't. They dislike being asked to do such tasks and are less likely to successfully complete them. It is speculated that women do better in these situations because they have a greater ability to keep their thoughts and imagination active, even during tedious activities. Okay. What's the meaning of restless, nervous? Again, restless, nervous. Temperaments, temperaments, personality or character. Capacity, capacity, the ability. Repetitive, repetitive, repeat over and over. Tedious, tedious means boring or tiring. Paragraph number five. Five, many people assume that since women have babies and men don't, women probably have a greater ability to deal with pain. However, the research seems to indicate that due to their body chemistry, women actually have lower tolerance for pain. During recovery after surgery, women tend to experience pain with greater frequency and intensity than men do. Tolerance. Tolerance means peering, peering. Women actually have lower tolerance for pain because men are more strong, stronger than the women. Six, women outlive men all around the world, sometimes by an average of as much as 10 years. For example, in the U.S., the average life expectancy is about 79 for women, but only 72 for men. The gap is largest among people who live to be 100 or older. Worldwide, among people 100 or older, women outnumber men 9 to 1. Expectancy. Expectancy is the noun of the verb expect. Expect. Now, are you ready? Are you ready to answer exercise number A? Vocabulary, complete each sentence with a word from the box. Number one, the space that plant hurt people are not smart is ridiculous. Ridiculous means silly. Excellent, stereotype. Stereotype, very good. Number two, we were bored and excellent, restless. We were bored and restless, so we decided to find something to do. That film is very repetitive. It shows the same place over and over. Number four, I always fear overwhelming, but Yes, overwhelming anxiety, anxiety, the night before a test. I always feel overwhelming anxiety the night before a test. Number five, the intensity. The intensity of thunderstorm made the animal nervous. Some people believe that the animal have the capacity to feel the same emotions that humans do. Louisa has a lovely temperament. Why? She is always happy and smiling. Number eight, finding sources for an EC can be a time consuming and tedious task. Tedious task. Number nine, the gender of an animal often has a specific name. 
For example, a male horse is a stallion and a female horse is called what? A mare. Very good. The next exercise, comprehension. Answer the question. Number one, in what types of sitting do women then tend to speak more? Excellent. Women tend to speak more in informal sitting, but women, women in formal sitting, but what about the men? Excellent. The men speak more in formal sitting. Very good, my dear students. Number two, what causes women to worry more than men? Excellent. Women's brains produce less of a chemical that controls anxiety than men's. Number three, what things do women tend to lie about? What things do, do men tend to lie about? Women tend to lie to avoid hurting another's feelings because she is a cute and elegant character. But men tend to lie to make themselves look more impressive. Number four, what might explain women's ability to deal with repetitive tasks better than men? It's possible that women are better at keeping their thoughts and imaginations. Number five, which gender has a longer life expectancy? Give an example. Women have a longer life expectancy than men. In the US, the life expectancy for women is 79, but for men, it's 72. Is it clear, my dear students? Thank you and keep, thank you and take care of yourself. Goodbye.